It's Moon. You know the deal. What are we doing in Moon? Well, another day. I guess that means some new music. I, it, I, it was confirmed to me that finishing the rocket does indeed lead to endgame stuff, so we'll withhold the final part of the rocket for the time being until we feel like it's time. Funkadelic pronounced hip-hop entangled with bass, female vocals, and earthy horns. Oh, that sound... Give me those earthy horns. Let me... Let me... I want to experience the earthiness. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is, number five. All right, what do I want to do? Maybe it's time to hit up the desert. It still is morning, but I keep missing my opportunity with the desert. All right, for one thing, there is some Yenum in this desert that we need to pick up. Because we were blocked off by Cacti. And here's Molio. Need to save him. That's what we're here to try to do. All right, yeah. Got that Yenum. Now, let's see. I believe, was this the fishing point? Let's look around. Yeah, there it is. I can see the fishing sign up there to the left. So... We have some bait. Let's just check. How much bait do we have? One, two, three. Yeah, we... Okay, we got plenty of bait. So there's a fishing sign up there, and it always seems strange that you can fish here because there's no water. There's just sand. There is one monster... Yeah, there is. You can see Molio. He's moving around. We have not been able to catch him. So I was wondering if maybe we could use this fishing spot to, to impale him on a hook and just yank him out of the sand against his will. It's for his own good because we're going we're gonna to catch him and save him and send him to the moon. But we have to wait for night to fall. So this cactus raises. And then we'll see what it is we can fish for here. Maybe there's some actual sandfish. I like these earthy horns. some music to fish to. Alright, here we go. What are we doing here? Tell me. I'm gonna go fishing. Yes. And like, it's just like a cloud. A dust cloud. Alright, got something. I'm gonna pull it up. What? Huh? I got Sanzilla. That one, I guess I messed up the timing on that. I'm just uh, in shock by Sanzilla. Huh? I'm catching some unusual, some unexpected things out of here.
I don't suppose any of you guys lay eggs. Because I'm I'm looking for some caviar? Need All right. I guess we're done fishing. Well, that was some un that was some unexpected stuff. Oh, I need to eat that. That's right. I don't know what I expected from that, but it wasn't that. I mean, I well, I expected maybe we could catch Molio. I guess that is not the way to catch Molio. Let's see, it's almost daytime. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Well, maybe something else we can do here. I mean, if we can't catch Molio by fishing, how do we catch him? Like, he still wanders around here. At night, like there he is. Have you ever stick your head out of there, Molio? Uh, he stops occasionally, but. And it's is this the description of him says that he hates sunlight. So I don't expect that he would ever stick his head out during the day. Alright, but one reason I wanted to go this way is because this will let's see, I believe it will lead yeah, lead us to a, a screen where there are two two monsters. We have not gotten either of these. We've got, not gotten Bird On. We have not gotten Sand Mile. Bird On is Big Bumbly, Cerulean, and Red. And Sand Mile is Black. It's not, not a bird. Sand Mile is waiting for the Black Bird. All right, you. Place a bet. Sh I have a. I have money. Sure. How much? Uh, I don't know if there's a reason to bet more than the minimum, so... Bet on which bird. Alright. Bird on is Cerulean. So, give me... Let me put it on blue. We're looking for a blue bird. Give me that blue bird. Give me it. want to see that blue. This is some this is some music to bird watch too. Oh. The first bird I saw was pale blue, yes. Cerulean. Brings reason and logic. Take this 100 yenum. Oh, well, thanks. I have this much yenum, but more importantly, I have bird on. Ten left. Okay, you. Well, let's go with black. Apparently, Sad Mile wants black. It also said that the black bird has to appear at night, but you're asleep at night, so I can't bet on birds at night. So I don't know what the solution is there. 
but I'm just going to sit here and I'm going to bet on black birds and we're going to see what happens. That's blue. Well, you got to spend money to make money. And by make money, I mean summon the soul of a dead animal. Maybe if it's late enough in the day and it takes a while for the bird to appear, then maybe we can make a bet during the day, but the bird appears after the sun goes down. Possibly that could happen. Well, that's a black bird, so I, I won money, but does Sad Mile want that? Black. Brings mystery from the void. Mysterious woman. Empty hearted. What views she with those cold eyes? A flood of sight and sound. Take this 500 yen. Um. I got this much. Sad mile. What do you think about that? Is that. Does that make your ghost want to appear? I don't see your ghost anywhere, Sad Mile. You want, yeah, he wants the, the blackbird to appear at night. There's another blackbird. Sad Mile, what do you think about this? Well, a blackbird might appear even if I'm not betting anything. So maybe if I just, maybe I don't need to actually bet anything for a blackbird to appear. Okay, he's not taking bets anymore. Alright, so if, okay, so birds will just go by regardless of whether or not I am betting against this man. Alright, maybe we just take a seat down next to Sad Mile here, and maybe we just, uh, maybe we just wait to see if a blackbird comes by. We got time. We can, like, stay awake for almost an entire week at this point. I like that the Birdman here is trying to get some sleep, and we just have our MD player blasting these earthy horns. This is probably my favorite of the music so far. I like how it sounds like a whip is one of the instruments. Well, it doesn't look like any birds are flying by. Uh, we can just sit with Sad Mile all night if we have to. I guess we could update the monster list. We have now. Oh, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> 
Sad Mile is a lot bigger than I thought he was, but he has been rescued. All right, I was about to update the monster list, but um, <laughs> Sad Mile made an appearance. Molio, are you ever going to stick your head out of that sand? Do I, what do I have to do to you? What, Molio, what do we have to do here? What, what can I do to get you out of that sand? Well, as far as right now goes, uh, we like got some giant fish. Maybe let's go back to town and ask Yoshida about them. Can we do anything about them, or are they just, uh, are we just gonna sell them for money? Let's find out. Do it. Swallow me down and take me back to town. Yoshida. Would you look at this? That's a Sanzilla. It'll net you a monster profit. Alright, he's just saying I should sell it. What about uh, this sand eel? Sand eel? If any shop were willing to buy that off me, I'd probably pay a lot. Alright, let's get monies. And we are, we, we've become a high roller here in Love to Guard. Oh, still asleep. Well, we've got to wait for those that lazy bones to get up. And then we will make our money. All right, he's still doing this. I assume he will not be doing this all day. Police without your crew and the equipment, my crisp comfortable. Well, I, I guess around midday, the king will go to the throne room. Hey, Bilby. was pointed out to me that I never got the guards cards so let's see if I can get them doesn't think anything of that what about the king's card can't comment on the inner secrets of the castle but I can take his card all right I got Bilby's card mm-hmm Cannot discuss matters of official castle business, but I can get his card. I got Fred's card. Tell me. Can you give me the straight dope on Bilby? Just gotta wait for him to go out some night. Hehe, <laughs> what does that mean? Want to give me a little bit more information on that? Tell me, you, Bilby, you can tell me what you really think about Fred. Every minute you're gone. That guy, I tell ya. If it weren't for my jostling awake every morning, you'd been fired a long time ago. Is the king still, is, uh, well, shambles? He's, he's, still, he's still out here. He's still feeding. Is 
Is anyone in the throne room? The shambles just never go in the throne room? Well, here's the minister. Yes? Yes, actually. Something's amiss. Oh, here he comes. What if... What if I were to show you... This junk, in a way, is to tell you that the king is actually shambles. Detritus. Some might say trash. Why his majesty chooses to involve himself with such individuals, jeopardizing the moral reputation of the crown, Gramble. Oh, actually, I have a couple of things for you. Not that. Here you go. I found your treasure. My word, whatever is this? Hmm. He doesn't know? I thought it belonged to him. I also found this white arrow. Duh? Uh. Hmm? Whatever is that? Hmm. Minister is not acknowledging this. Being king sucks. It actually is work. It is boring. Tell me, your majesty, what do you think about shambles? Mm, not saying anything. What do you think about the king? No? All right. What if we got the minister to leave right? I mean, I don't know how this would help us, but... What if the minister just came running out here? Give me one thing. Police without your crew and being equipment. My crest comfortable. Yep. And he just goes right back in. Now, if we could get Shambles and the King in the same room by themselves, they could switch places back, but how could we do such a thing? That's a perplexing sort of question. Shambles, what do you think about the king? Hmm, not saying anything. Hmm. So what do we do to get the minister out of the way so those two can switch back? Tell me what you think about this. It's got a peeper on it. Sanzilla. 600? Sure. And what about the sand eel? Sand eel. 300? Sure. Uh, one more thing I want to sell. Another sa Actually, do I have more than one sand eel? I have that one. Yeah, two sand eels. Yeah, two sand eels. I don't know how valuable these actually are, considering that Curio did buy a, an empty can for like 75 yenum. So many yenums. All right. Um, give me some bait. Let me just buy the bait instead of competing with the fishermen about getting bait. You know, I don't actually know what the hero's bromide is. It's very expensive, but we can just buy it now. Don't know if there's a reason to, but... Do I need this money for anything else? Yeah, sure, I guess. Alright, got that. Now 
There's a couple more things we could buy from his night shop. And money does not seem to be too much of a problem anymore. But there is something that I want to do here. So, caviar. Still haven't figured that out. So the clue about the caviar is that when we ate it, we heard a sound. And that sound is supposed to be the sound of the ingredients, or maybe where the ingredients came from. And the sound sounded something like frogs or crickets, maybe? I was wondering if maybe it was supposed to be like the ghost fish in the forest, because they made a similar sound, but no, it couldn't have been that, because we got the ghost fish. You know, they're done. So it's something else. Um, as for what it, what it could be, well, I was walking around the area at night. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell because we have music, but like I was walking around without music to just listen to different sounds. Um, and there is one screen that does have a noticeably different sound than the rest, at least at night. Which is the forest. In the forest, you do hear crickets at night, which again, might be hard to hear because of the music, but you can hear it. So one thing I was wondering, there is a fishing spot here. Should we fish at night because we hear the sounds of the crickets during the night? It, could that me could that be a way to get the ingredients for caviar? I guess I guess we're going to try it cuz Huh? What is that? I guess we're going fishing. Uh, uh huh. Catch? It's a monster. Shell whale. Well, I guess this is the one remaining one monster that I didn't know where it was. I guess this is it. A single tear drops from Shell Whale, which makes the water all pretty colors. Well... I, that's not caviar, but it is a monster. I got a moon fragment. Thank you. 200 yenums. Uh, all, all right. Why don't we continue to fish here? Oh, I got a. Uh. Hello, Iron Fish. Is that edible? And that is Sunfish. And that's an empty can. Ooh. 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 Ooh.
You know, this music is actually a pretty good tempo to tap the button for, for fishing. Another iron fish. I need more bait. All right, well, that was an eventful fishing trip. I, I mean, I, I came here for caviar, and I don't think I got that. I got some unique fish, but I don't know if that helps me. I got a chip. We should go read that chip. We fished up a new chip. What is it? Was a uh, was it a laboratory slate or is it something else? I get. I don't. Let's try laboratory slate. No, no. We've we've seen this one. Okay, yeah, there it is. It's just question marks. Ah, okay. There's a little hint that there might be some people underneath the windmill house. All right. Just a little clue if you didn't find that yet. We didn't, we didn't get any, I don't, I mean, we got some new fish. Does that have anything to do with the cavi, the, the mysterious caviar? I mean, caviar comes from fish, but I don't know how we're going to get the caviar out of these fish. Um... Let's head back to Yoshida, asking about these particular fish. There's this, the iron fish. Price selling that at a shop. Somebody pay a fat wad. Hmm. All right, so just just sell them for money. Actually, if King's going up towards the castle, we probably should see about that. Um, I didn't show him this. What is this? Where'd I pick that thing up? I don't like it. I don't like the smell of it. Smells too much like intrigue. Hmm. Let 
Is he walking back down? That minister doesn't even know his face. Give me one thing. Police without your crew and being equipment. My Chris comfortable. You could you, you two could just like change clothes right here. Like he's not He's not out here. Yeah, he'll just come right back out. Police without your crew and being equipment. My Chris comfortable. Like the two of you are in the same place right now. Oh, there he goes. Hmm. Life in the city is pretty rough. Huh. Alright, so they were in the same room. But they didn't do anything about it. Hmm. Well, it's almost night right now. Maybe we'll just head over here and wait for night to fall so we can go to the night shop and buy the remaining items that we have not bought yet for whatever it is we're going to do with them. Um, but as for right now, I guess what we can do, we can go back to the list here and we can update some stuff. We got Bird, we got Bird on. And we got Sad Mile. Which means these are now six and seven. Molio is now number eight. And a the blank one we found. Shell Whale. Okay, so eight monsters left. And night has fallen. Right, so there's the frilly dress. Do we know anyone who would want a frilly dress? We could ask around. And this flower. Okay, so night has just begun. Is there anything that we could do? Huh. It's an owl. We've heard about, we heard that owl hooting all around, but I don't think I don't remember seeing it. I mean, maybe we had no. We hello, oh yeah, he's out of his armor right now. I guess uh, he's in his casual gear. Doesn't need to be in his armor all the time, I suppose. <laughs> Just stripping down to your underwear and going to the bar after work. We've all been there. Divorced. Yep. We're gonna fix that. that giving you the oh, yeah. Right, the hero took her underwear. That was the legendary armor that he took. First up in here, rip through the dresser, pinch the lingerie. That's the price for him killing that nasty dragon? I guess that I guess we'll have to put up with him, I suppose. 
Um, what do you think about the hero? Hero, hero. Where is our hero? We, you know, I feel sorry for him. Swinging that sword around, chasing an imaginary dragon. It's been an age since he left the town. You know about the hero's armor? That cursed armor has been at the castle for ages. Whoever wears that armor has their hearts stolen by the fury of battle. The hard iron of that breastplate seals away the human heart. In that state, he'll be sallying forth until adventure until he drops dead of old age. Imagine that, clad in an in irremovable metal suit. That's a wicked fate, friend. We. SGF, our hero. What's he up to right about now? What wicked wilderness does he wander? We. Yep. That was a lot more exposition than I expected to get. And he was on his way to kill that bad dragon that ate the moon. Sure is a nice picture. Want a picture of her? Did I not get a... Oh, no, I, I did get a picture of her, I believe. I'm getting unexpected information about the hero. Do you have anything to tell me about the hero? I mean, you might be asleep. That's a perplexing sort of question. Okay, no, nothing special about the hero. Uh, let's see. It is the middle of the night right now. Um... I mean, uh, Yoshida said that... Uh, he just he just kicked that... Kicked the paper. Yoshi just said that when it was time to go to classes that he would come to our house. But, uh, I mean, I'm right here. I might as well ask him about it. All right. Come over to my house. I guess he went back to his bedroom. Yep, here he is. Can't talk to him while he's asleep. Can't talk to him when he's asleep either. Hmm. But how to get him to switch back? I mean, you think it's going to have to be in that part where both of them are in the, um, are in the courtyard. But the key is the green cat, but the green cat makes the minister come out into the courtyard. Minister's up and about already. I don't 
know if Flora would be in her shop yet. Let's take a look for her. Not yet. Huh? Yes? I'm a wise straw lamp. In the faraway valley of the wind, there some surviving members of our soon extinct species live. A faint melody floats by on the wind. Rumor has it that their lives are linked. You mean the dead flowers? I did I did just buy one. Great rose. A whisper wafts. Incline my ears, yes. Oh ho ho. The secret to preserving beauty clearly lies in the music made by humans. May your beautiful melodies forever neutrify us. Ho 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 ho. Great rose. Let's incline. Ho 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 ho. The secret to preserving beauty clearly lies in the music. No, we already we already got this. Flowers, life is a flicker. Their whole lives, it's almost time to die. However, if they could just hear Flora's melody. Ah, uh, forget it. It's not possible. It's just not possible. Because no one can even hear our voices. Mm, but, but I can. So what does that mean? The quiet flower. What does the quiet flower have to say? Ah, straw lamp. These rumors of yours frighten me completely. In some far-off place, I might have some unbeknownst friends. We should consider ourselves blessed, because we can hear Flora's song every day. Hey, Flora, I'm talking to these flowers. They're talking to me, Flora. I can't believe it. Flora... I think it's because I, I have this, the blue malingual. I can understand the flower language. You got to check this out. Oh, she does not want the blue malingual. Do you want a frilly dress, maybe? No, I thought I, I thought maybe I would try giving her either of those. She does not want them. By the way, has he... I don't suppose he went up to the castle at this point. I don't see him here. Well, nope, I don't see him around. There's got to be a point where the two of them are alone together and we can do something with that. There's the valley, and there are some dead or nearly dead flowers here. Well, we're not, like, given a prompt to do anything here.
And these flowers do look like the bloom lingual that we just got. Molio. Look, okay. It's the beginning of the night. Maybe we should just hang out and see if you do anything. Mm, lost track of Molio. We've now bought a whole lot of items. And I don't know if there's anything really else expensive to spend money on, but if there is, I guess now we know. I guess now we know where we can get a lot of money. The fishing spot over here. Losing track of them. I just I keep hearing like a like a sound. I don't know what that sound is or where it's coming from. Okay, I've heard it a couple times now. Cactus. Oh. Uh, got him anyway. Molio is out of here. You got that Yenum. And this music just makes it seem like we're just confidently striding everywhere. Nothing can get in our way. This bird watcher is all alone now. No, no longer has corpses surrounding him as he watches birds all day. All right, we tried fishing in the tropical forest at night where the crickets were chirping. Uh, I mean, we caught some stuff, but it didn't seem like it really had anything to do with caviar. Oh, what's this? Hello? Yes, sure, tell me something. Oh, quit her, quit her job from the restaurant. Feels pretty bad about leaving Kenji in the lurch, though. But couldn't serve some of those weirdos anymore. Kept thinking a talent scout would show up eventually. Though this place is pretty out of the way. The worst customer was that hero. Always drinking and yelling and getting rowdy. Just thinking about him boils that brain. That guy sucked. She splurged her savings to make a recording on MD. She's going for it. Gonna be an indie idol. Well, first, 
You're gonna need like uh, some headphones that look like cat ears. Just need a cute outfit. You can hold a fan. You need fans before you can hold a fan meet. Don't get ahead of yourself. I don't need the best not they up or anything. I don't need to put the best not they up. The best not they up or anything. I will put. Well, you want a cute outfit. <laughs> How about a frilly dress? <laughs> Scream! <laughs> what a majorly frilly garment. So fair, yes. <laughs> so attract fans like honey attracts ants. I mean, I assume that you want the fans more than you would want the ants. Time for the fan meet. Just put this on. All right. Time for the fan meet. Win at Cliss's game to get a free MD. What is the game? Rules are simple. Play look this way, win three times, and get an MD. All right, let's challenge. What? What? What is the game? Uh, what? Well, I don't know what the game is. All right. Ah. Uh? Well, I mean, that's rock, paper, scissors, I guess. But what's this pointing one? All right, I won that one. So we first pay, play rock, paper, scissors, and then I have to just I have to predict which direction she's going to face after winning. All right, it's two. She is pretty predictable about that. All right, so the the same the answer was to choose rock and then up all three times. I got her debut single. Don't forget to listen to it. I don't know about every day. I can't promise every day. Great, we did it. Good luck. Oh man, what happened in here? Oh, the hero. He'll wild out. Had enough of his bellowed frustrations. Apparently can't find the dragon castle. He's prone to thrashing about in loud frustration. He couldn't keep his hands off- Oh, couldn't keep his hands off of Cliss. She couldn't stand him, so she quit. Drives off customers. I hate to say it, but he's a nuisance. I wish he'd find that dragon castle already. Well, I mean, I guess we could help him with that, but we probably shouldn't. I was about to say, any cl more clues about this caviar? But, uh, I guess we're not going to be getting that. It's an iron fish. I'm just kind of wondering if we can get caviar from it. What about a mer person? No, I already asked you about this. Pretty sure I already asked you about the mer person. What about the sunfish? I mean, you already told me, but what do you think about the hero? Oh, what is that? Hmm. Well, bad situation at the restaurant, but at least we got the MD. But still no caviar.
Well, anyway, as far as the Valley of the Wind goes, uh, we captured all the monsters here. There are these dead flowers that the Flowers and Flowers shop were mentioning, but I don't know what we could do to help them. And we did get a new MD. And we are on a de we are on our last day before death. So maybe it's about time to head back to the house. Let's watch some TV. Hello. It's many. It's 44. Seven souls still wander the realm. Real nice if I save them. Alright, let's head to bed. Let's check out the love. Cliss is love. That is love. And the souls of the animals. Birdon, Molio, Sadmile, and Shell Whale. So much. Love is deep and further. I've reached level level 27. I am the love Yokozuna. There's too much love to handle here. I will need 14. That is, that is a lot of love. Now we're really getting to it. You need this much love to level up. Let's seek out the scattered love. All right. Well, we can go to the list. We can update it because Molio was saved, which means the remaining monsters are the mansion and Technopolis. So we have to get that caviar in order to do the mansion. There's like five monsters associated with it. Um, but we still have not gotten this caviar yet. We gotta get the caviar. Um, and then there's also the two remaining in Technopolis. Uh, don't know. Still don't know how to get those two. But then again, they might just end up being the types of monsters where you just wait in the room for a while and then they show up because that's the thing that's been happening. Seven monsters left. Much progress has been made. We have the final part of the rocket, the firework, which we could give to the doctor at any time, but we are trying to wrap some stuff up before we actually hand that over. It would be nice if we could save all the monsters. Uh, I don't know if we're going to save the monsters, but all of them, but I would really like to do that. So we will ponder this. We will consider... How are we going to do this as we continue on with Moon and hopefully find a way to save these remaining seven monsters before we finish this rocket, head to the moon and uh, find the dragon? I guess that's what's going to happen. And you know, something that hasn't happened yet from the game at the beginning is the hero would go to the metal tower and find the airship and go to the moon so I assume that has to happen once we once we finish the rocket. So really, finishing the rocket is going to bring the hero closer to slaying the dragon, which I assume we don't want to happen. Um, but I guess we will see if we can do anything about that as we continue on with Moon.